Praise be to Jesus. Hi everyone, Charles here with you. Well, just to reinforce the concept that communism and Catholicism um, do not go hand in hand, nor is there any room for um, compromise. You know, you just can't compromise truth. So, uh, well, I'm going to bring you this story here. It's going to be short. Um, Four priests from the underground Catholic Church in China, China's uh, Hebrew province, have been taken into police custody for indoctrination, Asian News reported Monday. The publication wrote November 5th that the priests are being indoctr indoctrinated on the religious policy of the Chinese government because they refuse to enroll in the Patriarch Patriotic Association, which is the, um, the so-called Catholic Church that uh, has, has the quote-unquote blessing of the uh, Chinese Communist government. The abducted priests, and they name, uh, they name them, um, reports of the destruction or desecration of Catholic churches and shrines have come from across China, including the provinces of one, two, three, four, and they name five provinces. Um, so um, that's all. I mean, that's all we're going to say about that, you know. Uh, it's just uh, evidence, um, evidence that, um, you know, what the communist uh, Chinese government says and what they do is very much like uh, the papacy. <laughs> you know, Pope says one thing and does something else. The Vatican says one thing and it does something else. It's just, uh, well, I, I guess they have that in common anyway. I, I, that, that'd be about the only, only thing. But uh, really, um, you know, I mean, there is no room for compromise. You can't compromise truth. And if we believe Catholicism is truth, um, this deal with the Chinese uh, government was just all show. Um, of course, for uh, this papacy, um, who is dismantling Catholicism anyway, or in hijacking it and using it to create a new religion, uh, perhaps uh, this new religion, if it lasts, um, which I believe it will, and I believe most Catholics will believe they're still Catholic and belong to um, whatever it is, Francisism or something, you know, um, the Christian variety of Francisism. I don't know what they're going to call it, um, you know, but, um, you know, um, somewhere down the line, um, you know, maybe their paths will cross and, um, um, you know, all these um uh, Chinese quote-unquote Catholics who are in the Patriarch Association, uh, it'll be okay for them to join the, uh, to be part of the um, Church of Francisism. I, I really don't know what to call it. I mean, I know I'm sort of being a wise guy here, but, you know, um, you know, it's very disheartening, you know. Uh, well, just, you know, one more story. You know, from time to time, I'm going to, uh, I get an email every day um, from um, um, uh, a, pl uh, a site called Bitter Winter, um, which uh, keeps track of what's going on in China and some other places, uh, you know, in the Far East, uh, as far as religious persecution and uh, human rights and that sort of thing. And, uh, I mean, I can bring you stories every day about what goes on in China. You know, China's a big place, got a lot of people. Um, and, um, you know, well, he, uh, here's another one I remember just off the top of my head. So, um, you know, government officials are, um, you know, just decided they're breaking into houses of Christians um, and um, saying that... Um, you know, they, they need to take down all the crosses and all this and put up uh, pictures of uh, the president and, you know, whoever else, you know, um, you know, his uh, left and right hand man, uh, say, and then pray to them. You know, that's what they need to do. You know, they can't pray to 
uh, pray to Jesus Christ, their Father, or Holy Spirit, or anything. You know, they, they got to pray to, uh, you know, and then they threaten them with uh, fines or this thing or that thing. I, I don't remember the particulars, but uh, that one I just, I think I saw yesterday. But uh, from time to time, I'm going to bring you these stories just to uh, continually remind us how um, foolish um, Pope Francis was in trying to make a deal you know, I mean, who who knows what that deal was about anyway, you know? I mean, we never read the particulars of what the deal was, um, you know. So, I mean, it could be anything. It was, it was just um, a show. All right, well, there's a prayer coming up. So, uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye.